Hi guys and welcome to an unboxing for my Thrill Club. So this is a monthly subscription box. I did one. They shipped it right away and so I did not, and that was technically the April box. They, sh they ship it quickly like that. So I did not get one officially in April. Um, so this will start being a recurring thing starting in May. So this comes with two, if I remember right, two books within the horror, thriller, mystery genre. So, um, this just arrived today. I was going to sit down and read and this came and thought, oh, let's go ahead and unbox it so that I can um, tell you what the books are and then I can sit down and read for a bit. So, that's what that looks like. There's no goodies or anything like that. Um, so I'll list the uh, website for this in the description box. Both of these books are hardcover. The thing, um, I either got it in the previous box, a little description, or it said it on the website, or both, is that sometimes you'll, you might get like the 6th, 13th, or whatever book in a series, but the curator for this box thinks that they can definitely be read as a standalone. So. I don't know if these ones are going to be part of a series or not, but where they think the company says these can be read as a standalone, that's what I'll consider. So two books. Both of these ones are hardcover. This came all the way from Knoxville, Tennessee. Okay. All right, so we have Steve Barry is the author the militia or no the malta exchange so let's see the synopsis reads the pope is dead a conclave to select his replacement is about to begin cardinals are beginning to arrive at the vatican but one has fled rome for malta in search of a document that dates back to the fourth century and constantine the great Former Justice Department, Department operative Cotton Malone is at Lake Como, Italy, on the trail of legacy letters between Winston Churchill and Benito Mussolini that disappeared in 1945 and could rewrite history. But someone else is after the same letters, and when Malone obtains then loses them, the ensuing hunt attracts the attention of the legendary Knights of Malta. The knights have existed for more than 900 years, the only warrior monks to survive into modern times. Now they are a global humanitarian organization, but within their ranks lurks trouble. The uh, secreti, secreti, mm, an ancient sect of the knights intent on affecting the coming papal, papal conclave. With the help of Megan Billet, agent Luke Daniels, Malone races the rogue cardinal, the knights, the secretary, <laughs> and the clock to find what has been lost for centuries. The final confrontation cul culminates behind the walls of the Vatican, where the election of the next pope hangs in the balance. So, Malta Exchange by Steve Barry. Copyright 1999. Okay, I'm going to log this into Goodreads because I want to see um, if this can be read. Or, well, obviously it can be read at a standalone, but I want to know if it's part of a series. So, Malta. Oh, come on. Malta. Exchange. There we go. This is number 14 in the Cotton Malone series. Um, book number one is the Templar Legacy, but there is a novella called The Admiral's Mark. So the novella, the book number 0.5, I can get for two dollars on Amazon, um, at the Kindle version, and it's a collection of three novellas or three short stories in the series. So I think I'll do that. I mean, three dollars, two, two to three dollars. What the heck am I doing? Come on. Delete. Let's try that again. So that way I can start with the novella. So that'd be pretty good. Uh, so I think I'll do that. 
Okay, so this next one I have pulled up on Goodreads, and this one is actually a standalone, and I have it marked on Goodreads that I'm intrigued by it. So I'm going to move it over that I own this one now. This author, what else did this particular author write? Okay, The Dry, Force of Nature, The Survivors. I think I have The Survivors. I don't have any of these other ones. Let me check. Yes, I have The Survivors. I knew this author sounded familiar. Um, and then there's several other, it looks like, possible, um, or at least another one. Anyway, the author is Jane Harper. So, okay. Uh, so this is a standalone, Three Brothers, One Death, No Answers, in The Lost Man by Jane Harper. This, I like to see when the copyright was on these sometimes. 2018. Okay, so I have not read anything from this author, but I do know the author's name. Uh, let's see, the synopsis reads, Brothers Nathan and Bub Bright meet for the first time in months at the remote fence lines separating their cattle ranches in the lonely outback. Their third, third brother, Cameron, lies dead at their feet. Okay. <laughs> In an isolated belt of Queensland, Australia, their, uh, their homes a three-hour drive apart, the brothers were one another's nearest neighbors. Cameron was the middle child, the one who ran the family homestead. But something made him head out alone under the unrelenting sun. Nathan, Bub, and Nathan's son returned to Cameron's ranch and to those left behind by his passing, his wife, his daughters, and his mother as well as their longtime employee and two recently hired seasonal workers. While they gr grieve Cameron's loss, suspicion starts to take hold, and Nathan is forced to examine secrets the family would rather leave in the past. Because if someone forced Cameron to his death, the isolation of the outback leaves few suspects. Okay. That does sound pretty good, so I guess they thought, oh, he died from the elements, but we don't know what made him go out alone or, or unequipped or whatever is what I'm guessing the conversation's going to start off like, and then things start to be revealed, and it's like, no, he's sent to his death, so basically he was murdered. So yeah, The Lost Man by Jane Harper. I've heard of this author. <laughs> I'm excited that I've heard of this author. Um, so I'm looking forward to that, because I do want to read her other book, or books I've heard of. So, yeah, I'm intrigued. So these are the books in the My Thrill Club. So Malta Exchange, I'm guessing I could be saying that wrong, by Steve Barry, and uh, The Lost Man by Jane Harper. Both hardbacks, and I'm looking forward to both of those. So they both sound really good. So that's it for this unboxing. Let me know if you've read either of these books or books by either of these authors. Talk to me in the comment section below, and until next time, stay true to yourself and enjoy a good book, and I'll talk to you later.